what's going on guys it's blue exorcist here and uh before we do the stream for spider-man today i'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna react to robocop rogue city this is their pre-order trailer this was dropped seven days ago so a week ago um like always you know i'll mute my mic so i don't pick up the back feed so that way i can hear the trailer and you all can hear the trailer without hearing it twice. Um, so, that being said, I don't know much about this game. Um, I haven't seen any trailers for it. This would actually be my first trailer. Uh, I don't know what it's like or any of that. So this is live reaction going in unlike some of the previous trailers that I watched. Uh, like the one for Lords of Fallen. So without further ado, let's go ahead and turn this big screen. I'll mute my mic and we'll get right into it. Aren't you tired of these prehistoric electronic games? OCP is once again pushing the boundaries of technology to bring you the ultimate video experience. Imagine a city plagued by violence and gangs a city just waiting to be saved. Now, imagine that you are the hero this town needs. Robocop. Order our deluxe edition and pacify the city with the exclusive Auto 9 prototype version. The super powerful OCP shotgun that will punch holes in enemies of order. And one alternate costume to do justice in style. Pre-order now and unlock even more content. What are you waiting for? Save Detroit. Have the adventure of a lifetime. OCP is committed by your side. Okay, so... So far, I can honestly say, I know these usually aren't the finished product as far as like graphic wise for the video, for the game. Um, there's actually a gameplay trailer we'll go check out because this video is only like a minute and 16 seconds long. So these are all the things that you get if you pre-order their deluxe edition or what they call the Alex Murphy edition. Of course, you get the base game, you get the prototype version of the Auto 9 weapon. OCP shotgun, the damaged armor skin from the Robocop movie, the digital art book, and 48 hour early access. So you'd play it two days early. Let's go ahead and see when this comes out. You also get the Vanguard pack, apparently, which is another pack that, I mean, it showed it, but I figured everything was in that first part, but you get the uh, blue armor from Robocop 2 and the pitch black version, so a skin for the Auto 9. PlayStation. So before it gets into this, we get into this. This one was a month ago. Uh, apparently this come out in September. And that's what it says. Reinforcements arrive on PlayStation 5 in September 2023. So this is the gameplay trailer. This is a minute and 35 seconds. So we're going to get into this and kind of see what the gameplay looks like. According to our sources, the attacks were aimed at catching the attention of a man whose identity... Old Detroit has a cancer, and that cancer is crime. A new crime wave sweeping Detroit has already claimed the lives of 21 police officers. Provokes a question. Can we put our safety into the hands of a machine? An OCP holds the scalpel. My name is Dr. Olivia Blanche. I'm a police psychologist. 
I specialize in dealing with police officers suffering from emotional trauma. Oh, What's hiding in that metal head of yours? I think we can both agree that you are no ordinary police officer. Reinforcements have arrived. Those trigger-happy maniacs have a ton of hostages. Drop it, scum. Anyone expecting a silver freak? Contact! Lewis, you're here. We need to get these elevators back online. It's Robocop! It's that service box, isn't it? I am detecting a short circuit. Wakey, wakey! I'm looking at the map of this place, and it's huge. OCP tracking device torn out. I am going to follow the blood trail. However, one aspect of your composition that has been severely neglected is your human side, your brain. We must smash that thing! I've heard people refer to you by different you names. Okay there, Murphy? Fire at will! I'm curious to hear which one you prefer. My name is... So, uh, I don't know. I love the old Robocop movies. Um, I grew up watching them with my stepdad and he introduced me to a lot of movies from that time and that era from when he was growing up. So, I obviously, I watched Friday, all the Friday the 13th, Halloween's, Nightmare on Elm Street's, Robocops. Um, he's actually part of the reason I'm a huge movie buff, but I just, I don't know. Um, I didn't see nothing exciting about this. Uh, we got 23 minutes of gameplay. I'll, uh, the gameplay just looks stale to me, uh, which nostalgia-wise, it's pretty exciting that they are making a RoboCop game, uh, but it just, the, the excitement for the gameplay isn't there, but that doesn't mean it's going to be, I've played ter plenty of games that have terrible gameplay graphics, and I've absolutely loved them. Um, Far Cry, for instance, some of their games, um, uh, Far Cry 6, the graphics are okay, uh, gameplay is a little stale, it, it just seems like they repeat the same thing, but it's still a good game, Call of Duty, it repeats the same thing, so the gameplay is stale, but I still play it, I played Destiny all the way up till this last expansion, I never played the last expansion, the gameplay got stale, I got burned out on it, but I still love the game huge Destiny fan. Um, actually, this shoulder here, I've got the Black Armory, a tattoo for the Black Armory symbol. So, gameplay isn't always nothing. Um, I might, at some point, eventually pick this game up, and it might change my opinion on the stale gameplay, and I might get really excited for it. That being said, I mean, we'll, as trailers drop, and we get more information, we'll do more. Um, I just, I didn't see anything really exciting in the trailer. Um, there's another 22 minute gameplay demo, one minute less than IGN for some reason that was dropped a month ago. This one was dropped a day ago, but, uh, I'll keep an eye out as more trailers drop. Uh, we'll continue to watch them together. And who knows, my opinion might change. And I might really want to get this game. We'll just have to wait and see till later down the road. Um, as always, I, I, I thank you all for your support. I'm always going to, every video. I'm going to thank every one of you, all four of you all, for your support. And for hanging in there through these videos. I know some of them get dull. Um, I'm actually pushing to get this... Game Let's Play going that I've been working on. Um, soon, I'll have another update on the giveaway. With some, uh, hopefully some exciting news uh, going on there. 
we will, uh, we got some updates on it. So yeah, I'll, I'll definitely make an update video on the giveaway, because uh, we got some updates on some information on Spider-Man 2. Uh, so, that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you, if there's anything you want to see, if there's another trailer you want to see me react to, I know there wasn't much of a reaction to this one, but there wasn't much to get me excited yet. Um, comment down below. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. If there's something you want to see, comment down below or go to the community tab. Uh, I always post there. You can let me know there what you want to see. Uh, if you like the content, like the video. It really shows support and helps. Um, so, wherever you are in the world, have a good day, a good evening, a good night. And as always... See you in the next video.